no, 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 no. This phone. This one right here is one hundred dollars. My mom can always hear me, so that's why I'm I'm in the basement now, so okay. Where do I start with this phone? It is complete crap. I literally named this LG Crap. That's just, that is this phone's name. Wait, when you hold this phone, it feels like a toy. You know, like those little plastic phones with the buttons on them and you just make a couple sound effects. That's what this feels like. Honest to God, it feels like that. They put no effort into its design. They just threw on a couple back buttons. They were like, bam, this thing's the best. Yeah. These buttons, I will give them this. They are tactile. They do have... You can press them. What? How did? What, why did the camera open? Oh, my God. Okay. Now my SIM card didn't work for this phone, which is okay. It could have been my carrier's fault. But this is absolute crap. I've only used this for a short, 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 short time. And it's crap. Um, videos, stream, at like any YouTube video, 480p. That's, that's its highest revolution. I mean, I said revolution, resolution, resolution. Everything is just confusing. Like all these buttons, they mean absolutely nothing. The phone doesn't lag, I'll give it that, but it can't be given tasks like this. Can't do it. This is, it's crap. It doesn't make sense. Why would you use this phone? So I got the Moto E. The Moto E is $99. This is $99. Which one would I get? The Moto E. This thing is a complete piece of crap. Motorola put a lot of time and effort into their Moto E. They did a great job with design, how it feels in the hand and stuff. I mean, look at this camera. You can't even see it. Whatever, I don't even, just, how do I use, okay, there it is, there it is, figure out how to switch the cameras. So there you go, there's me, and it looks crappy, crappy I say. I'm not even going to bother to do a video test. You know, the phone that I'm recording on right now, it's $113, $120 depending on where you buy it. This thing is 99 bucks. I would not recommend this phone for anybody. The only person is as like a very beginner phone. Okay? Maybe like a second level phone from a flip phone or something. This would be not even a decent phone. Like a phone to get somebody by. That can play like one game. You have three gigabytes of storage, which is still crap. The not code won't work. work. Like, you know, the code that it's supposed to be, you're like on here and it's supposed to go like, or something and it's supposed to open. That says like it's encrypted or something and it won't work. I'm like, okay. That was one of the reasons like I was, ex I was kind of excited. I want, really wanted to try that. So that doesn't work. Forget that. No, 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 no. And half the time this works. Oh, it did work this time. Wow, I'm surprised. They try to make up with, with with this fancy skin version of Android. 
it's crap. I mean, this it looks nice. It looks appealing to the eye. That is literally it. I hate this phone. It's absolute garbage. <laughs> no, there's no way. No. No. It's crap. I could just go on and on and on and on and on. It does, it's not worth your hundred bucks. I got this for $20 on Black Friday. I got my Moto E for $10 on Black Friday. I mean, God. And I looked all around the, the side of this phone. There was no slot. There's no spot or slot for you to put your thumb in and remove this back off. What you have to do, and I, I'm going to break this port. You have to put your finger in the micro USB port and, like, tear it open. Like, and then put your finger like that once you pulled it apart. And then go around like this. Ow. Okay, hold on. You gotta go around like that and then you can get it. This is not quality material. Don't even get me started on the speaker. The speaker is rear facing, which is already a step down for me because almost like every device I have is a front facing speaker. And that sucks. It sounds muffled always. It's just not worth it. This flash is like nothing. I mean, it should be able to do everything that the Moto E can do. Maybe even a little bit more. But this is nothing. It's nothing. The only thing from keeping me from throwing this down the stairs that I'm sitting on is the fact that um, if I threw this down the stairs, my mom would get really mad, even though I paid for this. This is not even worth twenty dollars. God, and I know people are gonna say it's only a ninety-nine dollar phone. Give it a break. This is a hundred dollar phone that I'm recording on, ten times better quality. Then you have the Moto E, ten times better quality, maybe even twenty. And honestly. They just threw some parts together with this thing and hope that it would sell. This is disgraced LG. This makes me want to throw up. I will almost never buy an LG product again. God. That's how horrible this phone is. It's horrible. Do not buy this phone. Just don't buy it. Okay? You can find way better options. And if it comes down to this phone... Don't get a phone. Sorry. Too bad. Don't, don't don't get it. What is this? And I get random messages like this all the time. This has been like the past hour or so that I've had this phone. To enhance your data experience, the connections through the Wi-Fi, blah, blah, blah. Okay. What? What was that? I still can't use that not code. I already told you about that. So let's go to lock screen. Let's go to um, pin. Oh, I actually found out how to use it. Okay, let's set, let's set this up and see if it works. Okay, it says not code allows you to tap a pattern on the screen. Okay. Now it gets a little grid. You can't even see it, but there's a little 4x4 four four grid. 3 8 times. Okay, so let's just go. So let's just go 1, 2, 3, 4. That's stupid. Let me try. Let's do. Firm. Why is it not working? <sighs> okay. Not code. Let's try this. Let's try this again. Okay. So one, two, three, four. Continue. One, two, three, four. Done. Perfect. 
you have a backup pin. So all you have to do is fail the knot code like three times, four times. Then you're on the pin. There's like no use for the pin. There's like no use for the knot code. It's like the, with a the biometric security. You know, you got a fingerprint scanner, but no, no, no. There's also a pin. And if somebody, your friend sees you uh, use that pin one time, <laughs> the not code is, I mean, the biometric security, it, that's already crap. <laughs> so let's try this dumb not code. I did one, two, three, four. Oh, I did it! Let's turn that off. A waste of time. It's literally a copy trying to make somebody, like, think, oh, this has a special security thing. But everybody's going cuckoo when the, a phone had facial, facial uh, recognition and, you know, allows the way to unlock your phone. I still can do it, but it's not as big. I'm telling you, this phone, I don't like it. Oh my god. Let's change that not code before I blow up my phone or something. You're just better off with a pen. Honestly. Whatever. That's it for this video. I mean, I might post a camera thing out. I guess it's not gonna be good. Honestly, this phone is just no. You probably won't seeing up be seeing a whole lot of other videos. You probably might think of some other things to say bad about this phone and then put it back on. And uh, yeah, so if you want a little toy butt, uh, toy phone that you can just like push your little buttons and you know. Play on the internet. Yeah, I mean, this, this is the perfect phone. God, it's crap. My mom's going to be down any minute saying, why aren't you doing your homework? But I just thought I'd tell you guys how much of a piece of crap this phone is. That's it for this video. I hate this phone so much. You don't even know. 12 minute, 13 minute video on how I hate a phone. 